The Bank of England policy decision is on tap and the market will be paying close attention to see what the central bank has to say as it gets going in 2024. The broad consensus is that the BOE will leave rates on hold at five and a quarter percent for the fourth consecutive time. Where things will get interesting is in the accompanying communication with respect to the outlook for monetary policy going forward. There is an expectation that BOE will follow in the footsteps of the Fed and other central banks signaling a move towards rate cuts at some point in the future. At the same time, the BOE will also likely not want to jump to any conclusions with respect to its battle against inflation, which should keep it from signaling an imminent rate cut. If there is to be one big change that comes from today's decision, it will likely come from the voting split. Remember, back in December, three members voted for a rate hike, while the remaining six voted to maintain the bank rate. Since then, GDP readings have been less than impressive. Retail sales has disappointed and wage and inflation data have cooled. To that end, we would expect there would be a good chance for today's meeting to produce a unanimous decision where the hawks relent and all members vote for rates to stay on hold. This development along alone could generate some GBP sell interest in the immediate aftermath. And if there are no votes for a hike and some of the doves get even more aggressive and call for a cut, we could see the pound come under even more pressure. So in our view, the best way to get a handle on where the pound could be headed is by way of how the voting split comes out today. But ultimately, no change is expected on rates, and we don't expect there to be anything too wild going on in the aftermath. That's all for now.